In this video, I'll be telling you how to market your Chrome extension. I'm also gonna talk about what method I used to earn $30,000 last year. First off is through organic traffic. Organic traffic is when people find your app through search engines like Google or YouTube. This will take some time to get people to use your app, but it's completely free and help bring in residual customers over time just by searching. Using organic traffic, you'll want to know the best SEO keywords to use. To help with determining the best SEO keywords, I suggest using tools like Google Trends, Ahrefs, or Keywords Everywhere. All are amazing tools, but Keywords Everywhere has more features for their free option. These tools can help you determine how many people are searching and which keywords will get you the rank in searching. Next up is ads. Ads are a great way for people to see your app on the first page when they are searching on Google, Facebook, or other platforms. The only downside to running ads is you need money to run them, although Google will usually give you a $250 credit when you first sign up. Social media is a great way to get your app spread around via word of mouth. It's free, doesn't take much time to write a quick one or two sentence blurb about your Chrome extension and how it works. On Facebook or Instagram, just write a simple post to share with your friends or join a Facebook group. And with the owner's permission, just put the post on the group page. But in some cases, you might need to pay the admin. TikTok is another great way to gain traffic quickly by making short videos that could go viral. Another free way to gain visibility is by listing your Chrome extension on the software marketplace. AppSumo is a great software marketplace where people can go and find great deals on apps like Chrome extensions. It's a great way to gain publicity since people are always looking for the best deals on everything, including software. My business partner and I actually listed our Chrome extension on AppSumo and got some subscribers that way. Next on the list is to find a marketing agency to promote your app. This will cost the most amount of money, but you have to do barely any work. Simply just find one on Google. I've never used one, but I've heard that they, they are great. Last is to find an influencer in your space to promote your app to their audience. I took advantage of this approach by finding a YouTuber who had 2,000 subscribers at the time, and we were able to get around 20 customers in the first month. The best places to find an influencer are YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. This way is pretty straightforward. Just go on each platform, write down a list of influencers in your market, and message each one. Going this route, you can either pay the influencer to talk about your product or give them a share in revenue by setting up an affiliate program so that you can track how many customers are finding you through them. 